Hello and welcome to Rakeen Report, the series in which we look at the features and benefits of the Rakeen Virtual Studio 3DS Pro. Now we're going to talk about some of the types of programs that you might want to make using the Virtual Studio. And a classic is of course weather, because there's a huge amount of data and lots of visualisation that you might want to use with weather. You might want to bring guests in as well to talk about what's going on all over the world or even have some guests in the studio sitting at my desk here who will be able to talk and consult me about the weather, the, the meteorologist that I want to provide me with real expertise. But of course, we want to start with the bigger picture. So we might want to look at the continental US, for example, and start to see what weather data we could represent. And being able to use a virtual studio and virtual objects gives you the ability to do things that you can't do in a traditional studio. So here we've got the US. We can see, obviously, that it's very cold and snowing in Alaska. But as we pan across the continent, you can see that it's cold and wet in the north and sunny in the south. And in fact, because it's cold and wet in the north, we know that there's a storm about to hit New York. And using the technology that's available to us, we can bring our reporter in New York into the studio here so that we can find out what's going on. So, Ed, in New York, how are we doing? Brr. Thanks, Ed. Yeah, here in the streets of New York, we're waiting for the big storm to arrive. Of course, I'm not really in New York, and Ed's just thrown to me in the studio, which is kind of weird because I'm here and I'm there. And that's to show you that what we're able to do with the inputs into Rakeen is to create a composite video like this, because of course, I'm not in New York and I'm not on the streets there. I'm in the same studio in Bristol against a green screen and I've got the weather video running behind me. So the complexity that Rakeen allows us to create images, to layer images, and to bring them into the virtual studio is pretty remarkable. So on that note, from a very cold New York street, I'll throw it back to you in the studio. Thanks, Ed. Ed, thanks ever so much for that report and make sure you stay safe out there. For those of us in the studio, we've seen what the virtual studio can do to bring weather to life. And as it becomes a more important story, we're all going to need better ways to tell weather stories. That's today's Rakeen report. I hope that that's shown you what virtual studios can do. If you have more questions, you just need to get in touch, or of course, you could watch some more Rakeen reports. Thanks for watching.